Oh, Belfort from Skyrim? Oh, yeah, that dude is a murderer. Easily one of the top five warriors of all time. And if you don't believe me, I'll show you. Let me show you the top five warriors in my book and see where Belfort stacks up against them. Oh, yeah, Conan the actual barbarian? Let's take a look at that guy. I mean, that's impressive. The dude can break a sword with a single swing. But his finishing move's kind of weak. Check out Bellathor. <laughs> the dude just stuck his knife through that woman's skull like it was butter. Butter! <laughs> Number four, Maximus from the Gladiator. Let's see him get down to it. You know, I can respect the kill, but dual wielding, that's kind of cheap, to be honest. That's two swords against one. Belthor is using a six inch dagger and killing everyone in his path. Number three, Legolas from Mirkwood. Let's see him, Merc. nimble he's like a cat but just look at this I think that's fake to be honest that looks like CGI to me people talk about Legolas being the most epic warrior but I think he is a stuntman I think half of his kills are fake number two William Wallace which most people know from Braveheart oh what an opener This dude has strong opening attacks, I tell you what. But after that, I gotta be honest, it gets a little weak. He usually gets rid of his weapon, and then it looks like he has a hard time with a one-on-one. -on -one. I mean, look at Belthor over here. What is this, a 61? <laughs> and number one, it's obviously Belthor, the town mutilator. This guy literally kills entire towns. And the reason you haven't heard about him is because nobody walks away alive to tell the story. I have seen him 1v20. And as you know, I am the most important investigative journalist in all of Skyrim. And I am following Bellathor very closely, very, very closely. Not only because he is the greatest warrior of all time, but I think he's a little too good, you know what I'm saying? Performance enhancing drugs, I suspect, or perhaps dark magic. Either way, he makes my top five list and he's never leaving. And I want a little bit of that action. You know, if I find out what he saw, we're gonna find a little of that. <laughs> So anyway, 
hit the subscribe button, hit the notification button, because I am going to make this a full-blown case, a series documenting what's going on in Bellathor's life. I think you want to know a little bit more about this man. Oh!